YouTube, what's going on today, guys? This is Girl Dad Cards, and I'm here with the next episode of my journey back into the hobby. After uh, about a week off, a nice trip down to Florida to spend time with my family, uh, I'm back. Uh, went into my local Walmart yesterday as I was out doing some holiday shopping, picking up uh, outdoor decorations and doing some um, Christmas present shopping and decided I wanted to rip something. I had seen a few folks on the old uh, YouTube ripping these new um, mystery tins. Uh, you can see the old ones back there uh, from a couple months back. Those were awesome. Let's check out what we think about these. Um, pick these up for $24.92 a piece yesterday. I think that's the basically the exact same price as the ones before. Um, but these are just a little bit different. Uh, the ones before came with 2021 Optic, 2022 Optic, uh, 2022 Prism, and um, <clears throat> 2022 Select Draft Picks. These ones, as you can see, come with one 2021 or 2022 optic, two select draft picks, and then a mystery pack. Um, I've seen some different stuff popping out of these on YouTube, uh, ranging from, I think, mega packs of 2023 mosaic all the way to, I think, 2019 uh, prism uh, cellos. I think I've seen... Hmm. some uh, 2022 Mosaic uh, hanger packs. Uh, not sure what else, but we're going to do a little battle here. We're going to do the GOAT TB12 versus Joe Cool. Um, sad to see him on IR for the second time in his young career, but uh, I guess that's part of football, right? So... In Joe Burrows, we got the, what is this, a value pack of 2022 select draft picks, the 2022 optic, and then two select, select draft picks there. So we'll do that. And let's see what we got for Mr. Brady. These things look pretty good. Uh, once again, I don't. I, I think the floor is pretty much the same. Oh man, did I get stiff? No, I did not. Oh, I got two optic packs in that, and then two select draft pick um, bot, uh, packs. So I I think the floor is probably a little bit lower than uh, what the previous tins were. Uh, but the ceiling is still high. Uh, you can still pull, um, you know, downtowns. You can still pull autos. Um, pull different kinds of parallels and inserts. Um, so, we'll see. We got an Isaiah Spiller. Jamal Charles. Man, that guy was a beast back in the day. We got a TB12, that's kind of cool. I'll put that in my personal, my PC. We got Evan Neal, Derrick Henry, and Julio Jones, and we got a rookie of David Ojabo. Uh, I think, what, he plays for the Ravens, maybe? I don't know, haven't kept up with that guy that much. Um, but, but yeah, I, I think, you know, once again, ceiling's pretty high, floor, not, not super great, but I'm I'm a big fan of the mystery, you know. I love ripping. So we got a Rand Mahomes. Once again, that'll go on my PC. Oh, Scary Terry. That'll go on my PC as well. I think I already have this card. And Fuego, Jameson Williams, and a field level Kenny Pickett. So nothing great out of those move on to the value pack um football is being pretty rough right now my i think all three of my fantasy teams have pretty much 
lost this week. Uh, my commanders got blown out on Thanksgiving. So it's it's just not great, but you know, ripping cards is always fun. So we got Troy Aikman. Yeah, I felt thick for some reason. Justin Ross, Drew Bledsoe, Andrew Booth Jr., Brett Favre, John Mechie, and that guy got buried in the depth chart over there in Houston. Is he injured? I don't even, I don't even know. I don't think I've seen him play. Got a, oh, that's nice, a Kyron Williams on the lasers. I would say that might be a hit. A Kayvon Thibodeau on the lasers field level. A JT, select stars. A silver, Chris Olave. It's kind of nice. A field level George Karlaftis, field level Gronk, field level Barry Sanders, another field level David Ojabo, and a field level Miles Garrett. So yeah, the select draft picks aren't super great. And sorry if you guys can see uh, the reflections of my Christmas tree behind me. Uh, just put up mine in my office today uh the wife is going a little crazy we have four christmas trees in the house um and she wants to add a few more but i'm trying to draw the line somewhere oh i got a stars let's jc horn zay jones it looks like it's a rookie too antoine winfield jr chargers Isaiah Spiller? Isaiah Spiller, okay. That's a good looking card. We'll we'll sleeve that up. Why not? I'd say that's really probably the first actual hit we got out of either of these. So Joey B didn't produce much, but we'll take it. Move these guys off screen real quick. Let's see if the GOAT TB12 has something better for us. This guy feels a little bit thicker than the other one, but not that much. So, yeah, so the commanders just fired Jack Del Rio the other day. Um, you know, it sucks to see a guy lose his job, but I mean, we've looked terrible in two primetime games uh the first being against the bears i think that was a monday night game or a thursday night game that we got blown out and then getting blown out against the cowboys on thanksgiving was kind of the final straw so got a drake london ap kenny pickett a Jahan dodson i'll take that it's just a regular um no no silver, but we'll go into my PC. And then uh, JJ Watt on the field level. But we'll see what Ron Rivera can do. I don't think the team is going to do any better, but maybe they'll respond to this guy because it feels like they just haven't been responding over the past you know, four weeks to what Del Rio has been preaching. So got Lamar Jackson. Malik Willis, Dan Marino, Unstoppable, Jameson Williams. I wish that guy was doing something. And a field level, Lamar. All right, so we got two packs left. We got the 2022 and the 2021. Let's do 2022. See if we can pull a Sam Howell. B. Rob, Jahan Dobson. I think it pulls something. Like I said, I don't think 
the floor is very high on these products, but the ceiling is, and sometimes that's just what it's all about. So we got a mica. There's a Sam Howell. Take that. Looks like we got a purple flash, so we'll hold on to that. Got a rookie sauce. It's kind of nice. And a Kyler Gordon on the purple flash. So we'll sleeve that up as well. Let's see if I can find some sleeves here. They seem to be hiding from me. So that's something. It's nothing huge, but it's definitely something. Um, yeah, I'm not a Bears fan, so I haven't really kept up with what Kyler Gordon is doing, but we'll take it. So um, last pack, uh, you know, I once again, um, are these things worth 25 bucks? I don't know. It, it's tough. I think the first iteration were. Um, these guys, I don't know if, if you get one of, you know, the better, um, mystery packs, uh, i.e., you know, one of the mosaics or one of the 2021 prisms, um, or I guess a extra optic, then, then maybe, I mean, you still get these two tins, which are pretty cool, but, um, you know, I, I think if you like ripping, you like ripping plain and simple. So, um, before I get into this, hopefully I get some last pack magic, but, uh, if you guys could like, uh, this, you know, hit that right down there. Um, and you could subscribe. That'd be great. Um, you know, trying to do a few things, just, uh, picked up a bunch of stuff on black Friday from Dave and Adams going to pick up a few other things from blowout cards over the next couple days as well. Um, so should have some videos coming out for you guys, including my monthly random pack opening. So appreciate you guys watching, subscribing and liking. So Heinz Ward, Jamal Williams. And I think this is just an insert. My house, silver Josh Allen, my house though. Right? I think that's silver. Yep, yeah, says prism right down there. So uh not terrible. Once again, fun opening, high ceiling, low floor. I think we got three three cards that I guess were kind of the best things. Uh I'd say probably the T B twelve won that. Um but Got the Silver My House, Josh Allen, the Purple Flash, Kyler Gordon, and then the Stars, Isaiah Spiller. So fun, as always. You guys take care of yourselves, and we'll see you soon.